Mary Cannon Pike County, Illinois. Our friends Jeff and David Lindsay were gracious enough to invite us to their farm again this year. Um, Jeff knows that I've never actually killed a doe with my bow. We're going to see if we can get it done tonight. We actually tried last year and we saw several does, but none within range. So uh, we'll see if this is the year. Morning. We did see a doe in the pond this morning and a pretty decent eight pointer, but uh, we're getting wet. It is cold and wet, and I think we're just going to keep hunting until uh, I start to feel the rain soak through my clothes and touch my skin. Then it'll probably be time to go, which probably won't be much longer.
couple of pretty nice ones. One looks like a four-year-old, one three-year-old, but not the deer we're after. That's, that's not the way you like it to happen, but any hunter knows that that's happened. I don't know many guys that haven't spined one. Um, that's actually the first I've ever shot a deer. He was out at 40. I checked him again. I thought he was at like 38, but um, that's a good deer. That is a big eight pointer. That was one of two big eight pointers we had on camera here. And we've had a great week. We've seen so many good deer and, and what a good feeling to uh, wrap up a good hunt with a great deer like that. <laughs> Well, 2020, Illinois has been good to us once again. We've had a great four days of hunting here this year. Uh, the herd on this farm has come a long ways. We got a lot of mature deer. Uh, we had a lot of good opportunities, but as you know, bow hunting is just hard. It's hard to close the distance and have everything work out, especially when you're trying to film it. But here on night four, this is a big mature eight that we've had on camera quite a bit. And that's the farthest I've ever shot a deer. He was out there at 38 yards with a bow. And um, shot was a little high, but uh, we took care of him quickly. Really thankful to come down here and enjoy the fall and enjoy a buck like this here in Illinois. 